Risk factors for ICH are largely all vascular risk factors. So hypertension being by far and away the strongest predictor of intracranial hemorrhage or ICH. So basically what happens with long-standing hypertension is particularly in the deep vessels of your brain, the, the arteries which perforate your brain stem, your thalamus, those deep core structures of your brain. Basically the high blood pressures within those vessels forces proteins into the walls of the blood vessel walls. That's called arterial sclerosis. 